Hi, today let's talk about how the method unitars.switch to main thread might be useful to you. This is the code that I use to check which files has been created into a folder and check if that file is an image or not. I'm doing that by using the file system watcher. I fill all the necessary configuration and most of all I feel the way to only recognize the JPEG files. And then I subscribe to the event of the file chance and file created. In on created callback, I'm gonna create a texture 2D type and then I'm gonna load source data from the files that has been created by using file with all bytes of the full part of the file system event arguments. I'm gonna load those mesh. I'm gonna load those data into the texture and assign the texture to it. The code seems fine, but this code doesn't run. Let me show you. In the editor, you see that I have the file watchers component right here, and when I hit play, I will open the persistent data part. As I list right here, it will listen to the part. I will open it, and then I will copy an image to this folder and see if the system can listen to which file is created. I will click copy, and I save. You see that it's already logged the message about the file that has just been copied to, but somehow when I create a texture using the file data, it didn't have any data in here. You will see that it's still none. The reason for that is, although it's my strain that it seems, the event handler subscribed to the on created is not actually executed on the main thread. However, the load image API from EUD needs to be on main thread to be executed. So, the solution for us is we have to execute the further logic in the main thread of EUD. And we're going to use that by using any task that switch to main thread. I will put a waste keyword first to be make sure that we are on the main thread. And I will put a since keyword here to remove any compilation errors. When you are working with some native C sharp library, such as the one that you downloaded from Nuggets practice manager, for example, you will find this problem so many times and there's nothing wrong with our code. Our code runs perfectly. The only thing that we need to be considered is we have to execute it on the main thread. So right here, I will switch to the main thread and execute the code to let you see what's happening. I'll hit play. Now the file washer is listening to when the file is created. And then I will open the Persistent data part, which is the folder that we are listening. I will delete this, go back, and I will click copy, paste right here, and you will see that is locked in the part that we are going to use. But then, what we see in here is it actually the texture to the file, which has just been created. You will see the image right here. The code right here is correct but you have to switch to the main thread before executing it. 